What's going on guys, Stiff here today with the Plut May Mutt player review and today we're going to be going over Andrew Luck, 91 overall, team of the week edition. Let's go over some of his stats, 6'4", 86 speed, 84 awareness, 94 throw power, throwing accuracy, 94, medium throwing accuracy, 91, deep ball, 86, uh, play action, 83, and elusiveness, 60. Just some general thoughts about this card. I think it's the best passing quarterback right now besides the uh, Peyton Manning, the primetime Peyton Manning. But this one, I believe, is still better because it's got 86 speed, which is very clutch in key situations when you are under duress by your opponent. Uh, as you just saw right there, it actually has a, a lot better stats than the average, you know, mutt quarterback has this year, which goes, you know undisclosed sometimes because mutt accuracy this year or just in Madden 15 in general the accuracy of the quarterback is very key this year just because you get, you see a lot of overthrows or a lot of poorly thrown balls this year so having that 86 speed with that great throwing accuracy as you'll see in this game is just so clutch with Andrew Luck and right before we get into some uh, gameplay, as you just saw right there, I tried doing the read option. I do wish he did have 88 speed, but I mean, let's be realistic here. Andrew Luck doesn't have 88 speed. The only problem I do have with Andrew Luck is when I do try running read option plays, uh, by uh, default, the computer will always play the uh, running back. So I'll always have to keep it, basically, with Andrew Luck, unless you know your opponent keys in on the quarterback, which can get frustrating at times. Just because I like the read option plays, just because when they play the uh, quarterback, I like to run it with my, uh, I like to hand it off to my running back, and that's what makes my play so dynamic, I believe, sometimes. But anyway, uh, regardless of that, uh, let's get into some of the gameplay with the Andrew Luck, as you see right there, just throwing dots all up and down the field. Not one poorly thrown ball. Well, there was one poorly thrown ball. That was because of my bad decision. It should have been picked off, but that was because of me. So anyway, we end up getting the touchdown, and then on the ensuing possession, you know, he ends up fumbling. We actually end up picking it up with our 99 Sherman. And then the next play, we do a little swing route with DeMarco Murray, and we get the touchdown. And those swing routes are actually pretty, you know, they're hard to throw sometimes, just because if you have a poorly thrown, uh, if you have a poorly accurate quarterback, you know, he'll underthrow it. He won't throw it in the right spot. He won't throw it while the running back's in motion, which is key on those plays. He has to be thrown perfect so it's in motion with the running back so he can uh, get some good acceleration as he catches the ball. So that's why Andrew Luck is another good quarterback right there. He just throws an absolute dart both to uh, Mike Evans and Brandon Marshall. Uh, he just throws it in, in great areas just so the receiver just can get it. But, I mean, he does have his flaws. You will see uh, later on in this game that he will throw the ball, you know, lopsided sometimes. He'll throw it in inaccurate positions. He's not by any means the uh, the best throwing quarterback, but he's definitely top three in my opinion. Uh, best QBs in Mutt right now. And I am making this as RTTP, which is Road to the Playoffs, is coming out today sometime so right now speaking he is the be uh, top three best throwing quarterbacks in the game if not the best quarterback for his mobility right now so right there we almost get a quick little three right before half we actually end up running out of uh, time but he threw an absolute dart right there to Vernon Davis and that's the key thing about quarterbacks this year is the deep ball throw and even the medium uh, ball throw those can be inaccurate at times I ha used to have the 90 Cam Newton uh, and he would overthrow those or just misplace those balls sometimes, those deep ones. And right there, that's a great, another great example of Andrew Luck being Andrew Luck, being with that uh, quarterback with that accuracy. Just throws a good dime on third down, gets the first down. And what you want in a quarterback is when you're in a clutch situation and you need a ball thrown perfectly, you need that ball thrown perfectly. And that's what Andrew Luck will do. Like that fourth and three at the end of the game, that third and two or whatever, or maybe that fourth and ten, third and ten, you need that throw. Andrew Luck will nine out of ten times deliver that for you. 
just because of the sole fact of his accuracy. See, Cam Newton, I do think Cam Newton was one of the clutchest quarterbacks in, in Mutt, actually. When I, I was in a fourth down conversion, he would um, do it for me, but can't really uh, say that he used to do it all the time. Andrew Luck just throws dime pieces all over the place. <laughs> so, that's basically my quarterback review for Andrew Luck. I'd give him an easy 9 out of 10. Uh, best quarterback in Mutt, I believe, just because of his speed. Um, that's basically it for this week, guys. That's the Mutt Player Review, Andrew Luck, 91 Team of the Week. Make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe this whole uh, segment that I'm doing. And until next time, guys, adios.